We in the middle of it, in the middle of war right now. <sighs> Mental, physical war. Pushing through these sets, pushing through this workout. Deadlifts is no joke. Yo, what's good, Activate family? We here. It's your boy Gabe. We gonna get a leg day in today, doing some hammy focused leg days. What I like to do on my leg days is get some a circuit going in, get my joints, my my tibia raises in, uh, sled reverse, help with my ankle joint, my knee joint. Get it started. Nice way to pump the blood flow. Get my legs ready for some deadlifting today. We can do some deadlifts. All right, some some good mornings, some Bulgarian split squats and just talk about how we feel. So one thing, especially for people that like to run, I will always suggest trying to do some tibia raises. I bought this nice little tibia raise machine on Amazon, right? I like to stretch my whole front shin, ankle, full range. I go for like three sets of 15 reps here. Remember, I'm doing a circuit, so I'll do this, go straight into some sleds, and then some lateral, Lateral squats, stretches. I don't know what to call it, but it's something. You see how it looks. So now I'm just making sure I get it. This is a perfect one. I broke my leg right on my right side. So I've been doing this ever since. Some therapy to make sure my ankles still get that strength in. Get my calves, my shins, and my knees all right. All right, next up, sleds. Yeah, so now I get into some sleds. So I love doing the reverse sleds. And then I push it for, I go for at least two laps, sometimes three, on this 10 yard. Perfect for getting your knees stronger, more flexible, more ready. No knee pains when you're running for those that wanna run. You do these tibia raises and these sleds, and it'll get your knees and legs real right. I like to act like I'm in the trenches with it. Get low, push. Drive my leg down. Sometimes I like to explode and go fast. Sometimes I like to just enjoy it and feel the tension, feel my leg moving, go nice, slow, dig deep. You do this as a pre-workout for your leg days, your legs is only gonna be monsters strong. Reverse legs, tibia raises, get that down pack. My, le my recovery since broken, breaking my leg has been going really good well. Sometimes I deal with foot pain though. I don't think that ever go away. I broke my leg playing ball last year, June. It's almost a year since I broke it. Next, I like to open up my legs. Stay nice and low. 16 count. Good for my hips. Keep that blood flow, right? If you can't do it with no kettlebell, no weight, do it just body weight. Squeeze one leg to the next leg. Open up your hips, right? I'm gonna do deadlifts today, so start mimicking some of the movements. Bring my glutes in. I do this circuit, three sets of them. Then I get to deadlifts. So yeah, right after that circuit, getting the legs, the ankles ready to work. I start with my deadlifts now, right? The goal is to do four working sets of six reps, right? This is a warm up two, two plates. Uh, I'm gonna go up to four plates. That's when I'll start my working sets. So I'll go up two plates, next set three plates, then four plates for six reps, four sets of that, and just start getting active, man. Like it's nothing to it. Start getting active. So I do. Conventional deadlift. The way I think of it is when I get to my knees, where I'm pushing down, pushing my legs down, when I get to my knees, that's where I start doing my hips, bringing my hips in. So push, 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 hips. Push, 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 hips. Push, push, push. 
All right, so now I got up to three plates. Still not working, so still like a test out my strength for today, see how I feel. But I start putting the belt on once we get a little bit heavy. See how we do. Get low, face up, chest out, hips. Push, 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 hips. Nice 10. Getting ready for working sets now. Deadlifts, they already got you. One set of deadlifts, feel like you did a whole exercise. Now you know why people hate leg day and after one thing they just walk out the door. But here, we stay active. Oof. This should get serious when you take the shirt off. Shit gets stuck. Oh right, yeah. So, I got Sebastian here. You know, dealing with Sebastian is not an easy thing, man. Let me just tell you that, especially when you're getting some heavy deadlifts in. But no excuses, four plates on there. First working sets, one for six reps. Don't try this at home, man. Now I'm playing push yourself, try yourself, test yourself, fail, succeed, then fail again. You already know the trend, but we not on trend. Just hard work. Chest out. Feels good, ain't nothing like that lift, man. Told you that shit. We in the middle of it, in the middle of war right now. Getting to it. Mental, physical war. Pushing through these sets, pushing through this workout. That lift is no joke. Let's get it. Leave it at five there. All right. Hammy's back, lower back feeling crazy, glute feeling crazy. Fourth set now of the working sets. After this, we do some good mornings, a good morning and a Bulgarian split squat super set. So it doesn't get easier, just more active. See how we do. See how I get five or more reps on this. The goal is six, but. If I feel it getting too tight, don't want to hurt myself, never. Push yourself, but try not to hurt yourself. That's the goal. Yes, sir. Let's go. <sighs> morning time get back into it them deadlifts gonna make you regret coming to hit legs man but you know we pushed through it got another super set crazy one to hit now is exercise number two right the first thing the circuit we did was a warm-up right with the sleds tibia raises right first exercise then deadlifts now we get into a super set gonna hit good mornings and then you're gonna catch me doing some Bulgarian split squats for 50 pounds on each hand we working, man. Lower back fired, glutes fired, and hamstrings already fired up. <clears throat> Get a nice stand, shoulder width apart.
awkward movement, awkward looks, but I guess that worked. And whatever gets you that progress, don't be afraid to do it. Get used to it, get uncomfortable, and stay active. All right, fifties in hands. Right after those good mornings. Let's get it. Hey, oh, working. One of the hardest things to do is put your leg on the bench, but you can't see it. So we getting it. Oh shit. Ah, yeah. Three sets of this. Catch you on the next workout. All right, so one of my least favorite exercises now, right, is these hip thrusts. Get into it. Get the glutes popping. We superset this, right, with a single, like a single RDL with a kettlebell. So you're gonna see me getting this in. The second to last exercise. After this, we did some um, leg curls. Burn out the hamstrings that way. You already know, man, feeling already kind of exhausted, but we pushing through. Um, the hamstring leg days, the back end, before we get our rest day in, and then start our next week. Enough talking, back to work. Same, same method, right? Three sets, try to get eight reps in. What some people like to do is too, right after that, no weight, and just hold it, squeeze and burn. Squeeze your hips, squeeze your hips. Woof. RDL time. Single leg, RDL now. Kettlebell. Focus, squeeze. Not easy. <sighs> Feel the burn already. Ah, three sets of this, then leg curls. So we finally made it to the finish line. We're gonna finish off strong. Some leg curls, machine, got the rack full. Gonna do as many reps as possible. Three sets, burnout, and that's it, man. Hamstrings is one. I don't know if I prefer hamstrings. Probably quad days better for me. Although I love deadlifts. Deadlifts is one of my favorite movements. But all the other stuff is cool, but you know, you just gotta do what you don't like to do if you wanna get better. Work on all your, all your weak points. I got chicken legs, so leg days is always a, a plus for me because I need to get my legs bigger, simple as that. So we pushing, three sets, eight to 12 reps, or as many as I can do. Let's get to it, leg curls. Sometimes what I like to do is after I, I put the weight, I divide the weight by two, get some more breaths and burn out. So, basically a drop set. I like to give myself a minute, two minutes rest between each set. Keep that blood flow, keep that work, keep that activation locked in. Ah. 
so we're in this dance room here. Getting some flexion on now. I'm not the best flexor when it comes, especially to legs, but you can see some of that work that we've been putting in. So if you don't know, I broke my right leg playing basketball. So I've been trying to regrow my calf and everything like that. Been pushing it, you see, legs getting there again. A little bit dice up, teardrop coming down slowly. Working, man. Hamstrings is, like I said, not one of my favorite day, but it's definitely an essential day to build up. You know, my genetics, I got long limbs, but they chicken legs, basically, right? But they strong. You see how I, put, uh, I do my thing. I try my best. Progress. If you guys got any recommendations on how to get better at posing and stuff like that, send them our way. I need to get better. You, The muscle is there. I just don't know what to do with it. But well, you're pushing. Next video we'll be doing probably chest day. Same method, talking to you guys, letting you know how we're feeling. Hope you guys enjoyed this hamstring focused leg day. Push through, you know, did lead lifts. You saw the circuit I do to start off my warm up. Good mornings, Bulgarians, hip thrusts, single leg de uh, RDLs, right? Man, it's a beautiful thing coming in, working out. The gym is always my playground. I'm always going to have fun with it, push myself. You see how it is, like, you feel me? Legs is getting there, though. It ain't look bad, man. Post leg day, post hammies. That's the quads, too. I need to learn how to do the hamstrings. Like, you see that line coming through down there, though, but shit, I'm trash at this posing shit, but you already know work will get better with it. Yeah, I already know the vibes, man. Hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like, comment, share down, and subscribe. Stay active, y'all.